up and down for Christian Bale. Yeah. The Dark Knight was a huge success, but he allegedly was very mean to his mom and sister. Yeah, but on the upside, he beat those charges, so... Oh. Allegedly. Well, no, he did beat them. But uh, now comes leaked audio from the set of Terminator 4 where, where Bale screams at the director of photography for the better half of an afternoon. Yeah. Now, this is rough stuff, even by Hollywood standards, where treating people badly is a pastime. So let's listen. <laughs> I want you off the f set, you f no, don't just be sorry. Think. Do I walk around and rip that? No, shut the up, Bruce. Do I want? No. No. Don't shut me up. Why the are you walking right through? Ah, uh, da 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 da, like this in the background. What the <laughs> is it with you? Give me an answer. What don't you get about it? I was looking at the light. Oh, good for you. <laughs> Dude, can you, seriously, get out of the show. No, I'm angry. No, come on. But you're, you're, come on, you're ruining our show. Can you just move? This is my show. <laughs> no, it's not your show. It doesn't even make sense. And be, like, guys, we're sorry. There's a pissed off Batman here in studio. <laughs> and now he's blocking our shot. Guy, come hey, on, dude. Hey, move it, Batman. Move All right, it. fine. Dude. But you don't know what it's like. You have no idea. Pray to me. What? What? What is wrong with you? Why are you so pissed off? All right, so Denny's is giving away a free Grand Slam breakfast today. <laughs> And I love their yeah. Grand Slam okay. breakfast. Okay. Problem is, I got there, and the line was huge. Well, <laughs> I only serve the free Grand Slams until two, okay. and I missed it. Okay. Well, I'm just so mad, so mad. And there's no one to punch. You don't need to. No one. You don't have to punch him. But well, <laughs> um, will you will you go away if we got you a breakfast? A Grand Slam I, breakfast. Yeah, okay. Yeah. yeah. Oh. I heard you. The Guys, first time. Slam. We can go, we'll get you. We'll get you a grand slam yeah, breakfast. It's coming. Get some cakes. Yeah. Some hot cakes. It's for free. It's for free. All right, I'll be over here. Okay. Thanks. Can you control grand your? Grand slam. I don't. Control your friend. He's not my friend. Stop he calling him friend. that. He's gonna think he is. <laughs> coming in at number four, we're looking at a fragile music video by artist Brian Taylor that. Mm -hmm explores the mortality of man. It's really gripping. Now, Brian made this video to honor his brother Kevin's 40th birthday, and folks, we found a star. Kevin. <laughs> Kevin is 40 years old. And it's a story. Thanks, Dad. You know, yeah, Kevin's turning 40, but his brother there was actually 23, so it doesn't bode well. Oh. Doesn't bode well for Kev. Um, and this artifact of humanity has actually been on YouTube for almost two and a half years and only has a little over 200 views. What? And I want to know how that could possibly be. That does not make internet sense to no, me. No, it doesn't. You know what? You know what it is? What? You know, I, tell I, me, because you know, that should I be blowing up the inner tubes. No, it's bald racism. Mm. So sad. So sad. You know, that kind of stuff shouldn't be happening in Obama's America. I know. I think there's a better way. I know. The tire swing looked fun, though. The tire swing We should get fun. one in the studio. We should get one. Do you want to sway like this, kids? Ready? No, that, that was awkward. I'm like, Dad, do we really have to stand here for this stupid video for Uncle Kevin? Oh, this sucks. I hate you. <laughs> it was a pretty sweet video, though. And number three today, we've got an excellent use of Microsoft Songsmith. Yes. Excellent. Oh, it really is. Because, you know, rather than trying to, I don't know, fix Vista, the guys up in Redmond gave up and put their efforts into an amazing piece of software that both creates new songs and 
ruins pre-existing mm -hmm. ones. It's a remarkable achievement. And all you have to do is, is, is give it some data or a voice and music is sort of automatically generated, if that's what you want to call that's it. That's right. Music. Now, Johannes Kriedler fed the current economic data into Songsmith, and the results will put a smile on your face no matter how grim the news is. One on mine. there, huh? Uh huh? Pretty low notes there. Hey, the good news is it's not all bad news. No, there okay. are actually a few businesses that tend to trend upward during recessions. That's right. Yeah, I really? heard that, that they were going to ask for bailout. Is that like a new move? I don't know that one. No. no. Oh. Well, I mean, like, it goes to prove my point, which is you can survive anything with firearms and porn. That's really all you need. No, you cannot survive a building fire. Mm, disagree. What? I disagree. You can't. I don't think it's, it's not how long you last, it's how well you live. What? <laughs> think about it. Woo! Think about it. Amen! Firearms and porn, you go out shooting either way. <laughs> <laughs> There are children in the audience. I didn't re really mean for that to sound that way. Yeah, I, number, I, I kind of did about towards yeah. the end of the sentence. I didn't think about it at the beginning. Uh, today's number two item. It's true. How, <laughs> how sad. How slow do you think? Uh, pretty slow lately. <laughs> um, Got to do research for that special coming up. Today's number two item comes to us from the Sunset Church of Christ in Lubbock, Texas. Now, normally when we introduce an around-the-net item like that, you probably expect to see some granny VHS footage of some embarrassing old sermon or televangelist ad or something like that, but not today. No, no. For today, we're about to see an ad for a local church that is not only non-grading, but it also has like a little bit of geek cred. Hi, my name is Jonathan, and I'd like to take a minute to tell you about Sunset's website. To help me with some of the more technical aspects, I've recruited some help. Hello, my name is Bobby Payton. The other day I was hacking around, thinking I was running port forwarding on my POP3 packets through SSH encrypted tunnels. <laughs> Turns out I got the port number wrong and I ended up encrypting all UDP traffic outboard through my router's gateway. <laughs> Miss Bobby, I've done that a time or two. Let's get back on track. <laughs> UDP track. Oh. Hey. hey, not bad, Sunset Church of Christ. Hey, now, do you think that Mrs. Bobby could help me set up an online store on my blog? You know, I'm having trouble getting the uh, CSS to size properly in Internet Explorer 6, and so she seems like no. a real thinker there. I don't think you, if you give her your information, she's going to turn your blog into, like, a bunch of photos of her grandkids and her bowel oh. movements and recipes and photos of depend. You don't want oh, that. Oh, I love recipes. You don't want that. <laughs> but congrats on the new blog, by the way. If you guys haven't oh, seen yeah. OliviaMunn.com, Thanks, by the way. Kev. Yeah, huge relaunch. Today. Pull it up, OliviaMunn.com. It is fap-worthy. Oh, it's a you, good did thing. you not think about it when you started? Oh, no, I thought that one. I thought that one through. I think that's a good thing. That's a seal of approval. You did good. You've done good. It's a good blog. Right. If you guys really want good. to see anything on Kevin Prayer, go to oliviamun.com. <laughs> Still ahead, not everyone is afraid what? of going to the dentist. Somebody's getting the gas face. That's yeah. coming up next, everybody. Excited. Today's number one is a post-op video. Yeah, oh, yeah. Kevin, no, 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 no. It's a no, dental no. procedure. It's fine. You're fine. Everybody's fine. Oh, okay. You know that's what fine. it is. You've seen it. That's fine then. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Now this is a video of a seven-year-old boy who had just come out of the dentist's office after having a tooth removed. Yeah, he was still a little bit uh, loopy from the uh, anesthesia uh, used in the procedure, but thankfully his dad had the good sense to turn a video camera on him during the ride home. Yeah. Yeah. He may not win any Father of the Year awards, but he does get today's top spot on ATN. How did it go? I didn't feel anything. Yeah. Ooh. 
Is this real life? Yeah, this is real life. Okay, now... Okay, now I... I have two fingers. Stay in your seat. Oh, man. Oh, oh that is so awesome. That's so sad. No, come on. That is, is awesome. Is this real life? <laughs> oh, you wish, and then you grow up, and you realize it's not forever. Oh, oh I've just, man, have I been there. That is such a good time. What? That is such a good time. Kevin. What? I certainly hope that you are not referring to a casual use of a recreational drug for non-medicinal purposes. Is that what you're trying to say? Because, Kevin, that would be irresponsible. And also, it would really set a morally questionable example for our viewers at home. <laughs> no, I'm not saying that. What I'm saying, what I'm saying is that I've had... What are you saying? I'm saying what are you that saying? I've had that experience at a dentist before. It's pretty common. It's not, I mean, it happens. Not you know? at my dentist. Well, you're going to the wrong guy, apparently. <laughs> Are you afraid to go to the dentist? Scared a little cavity might leave your mouth feeling sore in the morning? Well, worry no more. Hi there, I'm Dr. Pangolin, an alternative medicine dentist who specializes in painless procedure. While other dentists may use Novocaine and nitrous oxide, I use more effective methods to relax you before, during, and well after the procedure. If you want to come chill out and split a brownie before your root canal, that's, that's cool. Or just grab a handful of pills from the pill jar. And don't just take it from me. Here's what some of my actual patients have to say. I was worried about having some crowns put on, but after Dr. Pangolin roofied me, I don't care about anything. Uh, I can get an appointment for opium teeth whitening anytime. Even at three in the morning, four times a week. Is that a window? Or a tiny eye? And of course, we cater to all types, even demanding big time star athletes. So, give me a call anytime. Or look for my state of the art mobile office. Remember, when you want to get healed and get totally high, you've got to go to Dr. Penguin. Oh, he's so good. He's so good. Where is that office again? I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you after the show. Okay. And just keep it a secret, all right? Okay, okay good. Yeah, good. Okay, cool. To get your daily viral fix and to check out all the viral videos we have to offer, go to g4tv.com slash... Around the net. And don't forget to catch tonight's Midnight Show featuring ATN After Hours with an exclusive sexy video. Ooh, what do we have tonight, Olivia? Well, tonight, that's Nicole Kelly right well, there. Nicole Kelly. She's a bikini.com all star of she and is. was voted one of the hottest Hooters girls in America. Ooh. Dive into her hot sauce and judge for yourself oh. tonight, After Hours. Oh. Mom's gonna be fresh. <laughs>